So seeing everything that we've done so far tonight, I decided that I'd like to share with you a dessert recipe, pizza recipe, that has been a big hit when I made it before. It's a recipe that I found online and adapted, and it's really just delicious and wonderful. It is a peanut butter um, cup brownie dessert pizza, and you don't need that many ingredients, and it's really easy to make. So here are the ingredients that you need. So you'll need um, some sort of box brownie mix and then whatever ingredients um, the back of the box says to have. So this one calls for eggs and water and vegetable oil. Um, and then you need peanut butter and condensed milk. That's going to be like the, the sauce of the pizza. And then you want your toppings. So the toppings that I chose for our pizza tonight are going to be chocolate chips which we're going to melt to put on top. Your favorite peanut butter cups, I chose the dark chocolate thins because I like dark chocolate and I like these are a little bit thinner. And then for some color, to kind of be like pepperoni on the pizza, um, some Reese's Pieces. Um, so those are the ingredients that you need uh, for the recipe. The next, so the first part of this recipe is making the boxed brownies and making the actual pizza dough. Um, so all you're going to do is follow the directions on the box and then you just need a round uh, tray of some sort, like a pizza tray. I put, this one has holes in the bottom of it, so I just put some aluminum foil on it and you're going to lightly grease it and then make your box brownie mix and pour it on top. Um, it, it'll spread out as it's baking, um, so it's not a big deal if it kind of gathers in the middle of the pan. So I actually already did that step. Brownies should be done. Um, you want to follow the directions on the box for baking the brownies and then just check them a little bit sooner than the box says with a toothpick just to make sure that they're fully cooked through. And so this is what it looks like. And now we'll get started on our peanut butter sauce and toppings. Right, so now we're going to make our peanut butter sauce and all you need for the peanut butter sauce is a cup of creamy peanut butter and then a let me check the ounce on this a 14 ounce can of sweetened condensed milk. So what you're gonna do you want um, to just have a pan and I just put um, the heat on low and then I'm gonna get my peanut butter ready. So once your peanut butter is in the pan and starting to melt, you can get your um, sweetened evaporated, sweetened condensed milk and dump it in. And then you're gonna mix it together. Okay, hold on. Oh, this is the same. Alright, so once it all comes together and it's all the same consistency, it'll look like this. Um, and then you don't want to overcook it, so I'm gonna turn this off. And then we'll get ready to decorate our pizza. Okay, so now we're getting ready to uh, put the sauce and on and decorate our pizza. We have our peanut butter sauce, and then we have um, peanut butter cups, which are just kind of chopped up into quarters. I have Reese's pizza, and then I have half a cup of chocolate chips that I put in a measuring cup that I'm going to melt in the microwave, um, just kind of putting it in for 30 seconds at a time, checking occasionally, maybe every 10 seconds. And then I have it in a measuring cup just so it's easier to pour on afterwards. So let me get started with that. Okay, well so now we're get getting ready to decorate. Our first um, step is to ice our um, brownie with our peanut butter mixture. So I'm just about finished spreading the peanut butter mixture on top. I tried to leave a little bit around the edges um, just to make give it the crust feel, but um, it does not need to be perfect. So now we can decorate it. I have melted chocolate chips um, that I'm just going to um, kind of drizzle on top. So now you can just kind of spread 
your peanut butter cups all over. There you have a peanut butter brownie pizza.